With over 10,000 employees, 33 wind turbines and over $64 million donated to charities in 2019 alone, Valero Energy is the United States' largest low-carbon renewable fuels producer. With ticker symbol VLO, Valero Energy are an energy company operating in the USA, Canada and the UK. The company's website shows Valero are adapting with the energy sector by branching out into more renewable energy sources. This can be seen with their recent $80 million investment into a new wind farm in Texas. With the UK, Australia and other countries aiming to achieve net zero emissions by 2050, along with increasing pressure for governments to adopt safer and cleaner energy sources for their country, we must ask the question, should you buy Valero Energy stock? VLO is currently trading at $60.13, which gives a PE ratio of just 10.33. A PE ratio like this is extremely low, showing that the stock is currently undervalued and a great buy at this moment in time. Especially when comparing the PE ratio to other stocks in the renewable energy sector that have a median PE ratio of 39.94. The market cap is at $24.58 billion with a beta of 2.18. This shows that the stock can be very volatile compared to the general market. This can also be seen just by looking at the stock price chart of Valero Energy. Now this does seem to be quite unusual as companies in the energy sector tend to have a beta of just over 1.1 which is far less volatile. In the past 13 weeks VLO's stock price is up 46.33%. However, it does start to drop off the further back we go. In the past 26 weeks, Valero is only up 8.96% and even negative by 28.01% in the recent year. This can be attributed to the COVID-19 crash we saw around about this time last year. That along with the stock's very volatile nature. However, it does look to have recovered and even performed quite well. So now we will check the stock's performance compared to the S&P 500 over the past year. Again, Valero is down 38.88%, but this could be because investors use ETFs to battle market crashes. However, in the recent 13 weeks, Valero Energy stock is outperforming the S&P 500 by 28.84%. The free month volume of the stock is 96.3 million and is primarily owned by Vanguard who own a whopping 17% of Valero Energy. The rest of the stock is owned by numerous hedge funds and investment banks. So if the stock is good enough for the professionals, it is more than good enough for the average investor like myself. Also it is good to note that Vanguard are currently buying even more Valero stock since it is currently undervalued. In the last fiscal year, VLO had $2.05 billion in free cash flow, which is very large. This is just more than enough to keep operations going for a full two years. The current and quick ratios are at 1.44 and 0.91 respectively. And these ratios are not amazing, but not the worst number either. VLO pays its investors dividends with a high dividend yield of 6.79%. Despite having a high dividend yield, the payout ratio is only 61.78% of Valero's revenue. This is a great payout ratio, especially with the high dividends Valero offers. Furthermore, there is still plenty of room for Valero to grow its dividend yields, which we will talk about later. The balance sheet shows Valero Energy have $53.86 billion worth of assets and just over $32 billion in liabilities. This gives a debt to asset ratio of 59.52%, which again doesn't show great financial strength, but doesn't show financial weakness either. As mentioned before, Valero Energy pays its investors dividends with a dividend yield of 6.79%. Now these dividends are paid quarterly. Let's run through an example and if we are to buy $10,000 worth of Valero Energy stock and reinvest all of our dividends, making the assumption that the stock remains at the same price and the dividend yield remains at a flat rate, after 5 years we would receive $4,002.50 in just dividends alone. And it gets better from there. 
holding the stock for 10 years, our position would be worth $19,607 on the dot. Over 20 years, we would receive a whopping $27,729.35 in just dividends alone. To put this into perspective, we would make back the original investment of $10,000 in the 10th year of ownership of the stock from dividends alone. This is also assuming that there's no dividend growth whatsoever, but Valero's dividends have had a growth of 14.47% in the last three years. With a good dividend history and potential growth for its dividends, Valero Energy is a fairly safe dividend paying stock. In the 2019 fiscal year, Valero Energy have been operating at a low net profit margin at only 2.57% and have also seen a 5 year average of only 3.09%. Low net profit margins like we see here are not too uncommon among companies within the energy sector. Furthermore, Valero Energy are handling huge sums of money, so having a low net profit margin doesn't mean the profits they are making are also small. In the past 5 years, Valero's revenue growth is up 12.71%, which is fair growth. However, in the recent 3 years, Valero Energy have seen a 3.71% revenue decrease, so they have definitely dipped recently. However, the revenue growth in the past 5 years is still fair, which is a better indicator for growth for long term investors. Having said that, the net profit margin over the past 5 years has also decreased by 2.29%. But this can be attributed to the fact that Valero are branching out into the new renewable energy sector. This leads me to my next point. Does Valero Energy have a good future? Well, the company is adapting along with the new world and due to the size of Valero Energy, the company can afford to heavily invest and incur negative profit margins into new technology, marketing and other factors to really boost their exposure and dominance in these growing sectors. Again we will be using our programming to forecast the future price of Valero Energy using ARIMA modelling based on past data of its prices. We will be using data starting in the new year of 2018 and forecasting 200 days ahead of the present. As you can see the forecast predicts the price to remain at a level constant which isn't great to see. However, the data from 2018 includes the COVID-19 crash, which heavily affects the forecasting. Moving over to tip ranks, it is currently rated as a strong buy from analysts. This is a result from 7 out of 8 analysts suggesting to buy Valero Energy with an average upside of 14.33%. Furthermore, the analyst that didn't suggest buying VLO has still rated it a hold. Analysts at tip ranks have loved this stock with mostly strong buys in the past year. This confidence in analysts show that the current fair price price is a good buy for the long term. It is good to note that these forecasts are not 100% accurate and do not account for any external factors that can affect the stock's price. In conclusion, Valero Energy stock is currently very cheap, which gives it a very low PE ratio. However, the stock can be very volatile. The stock does have fair current and quick ratios with a good balance sheet indicating the company is fairly financially strong. Valero Energy pays out high dividends to its investors which have grown a lot in the past 3 years along with the potential to keep growing. The company's net profit margins are low but revenue has seen fair growth over the past 5 years. Finally, the stock's price saw neutral growth when forecasted in R along with strong buys from tip rank analysts. So, should you buy Valero Energy stock at this moment in time? I am giving the stock two ratings for two different types of investors. If you are primarily a dividend investor, then the rating of this stock for you is a strong buy. This is because of the high dividend benefits, along with reinvesting the dividends earned can generate wealth very quickly. For potential growth stock investors, the stock is a weak buy as Valero Energy doesn't show great growth potential. In conclusion, this stock overall is a good addition to any portfolio, but will require some work in constantly checking up your position due to the volatile nature of Valero Energy share price. I personally own 6.2 shares of this company, 3.3 of which were bought this month alone. Valero Energy is one of those companies that I plan to buy more shares of in the future. This stock for me has been a good performing stock which generates a great source of income by the means of dividends. 
Thank you very much for watching the video. If you want to get into the stock market, I have a link in the description below, where if you sign up, we will both get a random stock that can be valued up to $100 completely free of charge. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe for more stock analysis videos just like this. In my next video, I'll be showing my entire portfolio, along with my past monthly transactions and income generated from my positions. Don't be afraid to comment any stocks you want me to analyze in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching once again, goodbye.